This is our video number five on indirect material procurement cycle in SAP. And in this video, we are going to post a logistic invoice. We are going to record, we are going to post an invoice. We can use the transaction code, which is Miro. So on receipt of that invoice from the vendor, we need to post the logistic invoice. We can use the transaction code Miro. And to, uh, when we enter this transaction code Miro, we can fill the following data. We can enter the document date, posting date, purchase order number. With reference to the purchase, bins, uh, with reference to the purchase order number, it will uh, copy paste all the items from the, uh, from the purchase order into our logistic invoice. So how to record, how to post a logistic invoice for our indirect material or our consumable item in SAP. For that, we need to go in logistics. In logistics, we have materials management. In materials management, we have logistic invoice verification. In logistic invoice verification, we have a document entry. In document entry, we have first option, which is Miro, enter invoice. So you can double click this or you can press enter. So when you double click this, Miro enter invoice this window will open so here I'm going to enter the invoice date tab you can mention that invoice reference number let's suppose it is double six double five that is a posting date we need to check this option calculate tax and I'm going to select the text code which is B1 and now we need to select the purchase order number so open this Select the vendor. So the vendor is the hardware company to buy and execute. So when you execute, it will open the purchase order list. You can drop down this. So right now we order uh, one item which is repairing tools. The quantity is two. So you can drop down a uh, flap this, select this and click on this copy. Press enter. So when you press enter, it will copy paste the purchase order in our logistic invoice so that is our uh, repairing toolkit the quantity is two the total amount of this invoice that is 200 with the tax it is 210 that is a GL uh, account so we need to balance this because right now it is out of balance so click on this amount that is 210 press enter so when you press enter uh, enter it changes the color changes from red to green so balance uh, equation is balanced you can click this the payment tab here you can see the terms and condition that is a B line date the baseline date that is the due date of the invoice that is the payment terms and condition you can add further detailed information here that is related with the tax so that is 5% input tax so that is 10 there huh? and now I want to save this logistic, logistic invoice so I'm gonna simulate this so before posting or before saving, you can simulate your invoice. So it will give us an overview. That is how our entry look like. So this is how you can simulate this. And the last thing we, what we need to do, we need to post this invoice. So you can click this option to post. So this is how you are going to post a logistic invoice for your indirect material for your consumable item in SAP. So this is our uh, document number, which is 608902. That is our document. 